Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to Brian's comic book showcase for today. We're going to do, yay, we're going to do Superman. Superman created 1938-37 by Jerry Siegel and Joe Schuster for DC Comics. We're going to get right to it. We're going to show our extensive little paperback uh, hardcover collection here. Starting off with uh, the archives, DC Archives edition of Superman Action Comics. This is a compilation of Action Comics number 1 through 20. First Superman story. We also have archive edition of the Superman. These are the first for Superman and we got his solo comic book and one through four is featured in this edition and also we're still in the golden age we've got paperback now golden age Superman we've got golden age Batman golden age Wonder Woman a lot of good stuff this is a this is both action comics and Superman this is volume one great stuff Superman was originally created by Jerry Siegel, Joe Schuster to be featured in the uh, newspaper strips. And they got a call from DC, the publisher, they said, we want your stuff. I'm going to put it in a, our number one uh, action comics. And so later on, they finally got a shot as uh, put themselves into the newspapers. And this is the volume of the first Sunday strips and this is a volume of the first Superman daily strips in paperback great stuff great stuff great stuff and moving on from golden age into the 50s we have Superman showcase here this is volume one that's Brainiac on the cover there this starts in the 50s. Wayne Bourne was the main Superman artist at that time. We're going to move swiftly forward and we got Superman Showcase Volume 2. That is kind of go on the cover and also Volume 3 Superman Showcase all the Silver Age stories now we got Wayne Borden's moved out and they got Kurt Swan, Al Plastino, his main Superman artist. And by the time 60s rolled along, you pretty much got Kurt Swan as the main Superman artist. He was probably my favorite. Got the good, good old Lex Luthor stories. Superman in the 60s, we're gonna move on to some smaller paperbacks that I have here, Superman in the 60s. I'd like to have Superman in the 50s and the 70s too. Those are great volumes. There you go. We have Superman, of course, featured in World's Finest Comic Books. At first, it started off uh, Batman and Superman together in World's Finest, and they were separate. They had their own stories, and then they decided to team them up. So now you got Batman and Superman. And Dick Sprang was the main artist in those days. I'm going to move right up to the volume two now. The 50s roll into the 60s, world's finest stories. You have Kurt Swan doing some stories, still some Dick Sprang stories, and here you go. This is volume three, where it's mostly really just Kurt Swan doing the work. These are some great issues in this in the 60s. Superman's Showcase, World's Finest Stories, Batman and Superman team up. After a while, when the Batman TV show came out, Batman got top billing for a while. This is a pretty good volume here. Krypton, John Byrne Stories. Fantastic stuff. So another volume, Krypton Stories, Superman. Tales of a Lost Civilization. 
World of Krypton. Superman vs. Zod. This is a fantastic issue here. Compilation. General Zod, of course, was in the Man of Steel. We also have, can't do without any collection for a while there. They decided to kill Superman. They killed him off. All the writers got together in a room and he said, what are we going to do? I, I know, let's kill him. And but eventually they brought him back, of course. And brought him back. And now let's be reaching a little bit further. And this is Alex Ross. This is a large book. This is a beautiful book. Beautiful artwork. Superman. Peace on Earth. Yes, indeed. Superman. We need some peace. Superman, peace on Earth. Beautiful artwork. Alex Ross is the he's the boss. And yet we're going to finish up with our milestone issue of Action Comics 1000. Came out a little while ago. This is a gem. This is Superman's 1000th issue in action. Love that cover. Beautiful stuff. Okay, anyway, thanks for watching. And that's Superman for the day. Hope you have a great day. And thanks. I'm glad to come in and visit with you for a little while. And enjoy your afternoon. And thanks for watching.